What is up guys, welcome back to another reaction. We're about to be watching the top 10 largest animals on the planet. Somebody suggested this in one of my last videos, I think it was a couple couple days ago, maybe even a week ago. I just now seen the comment and I was like, you know what? That seems very, very interesting because what's the top 10 largest? I know like a great white, great white whale. That's not it. Uh, like a, the, a great white shark. That's pretty big. A damn whale's pretty big. I don't know. I don't know. We're about to find out. If you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button. We're on the road to 2,000 subscribers. I love you guys so much. I really do. Go ahead. Drop a like on this video if you want to see more videos like this. And let me know down in the comments why I should react to next. Other than that, let's get into it. We will explore the top 10 largest animals on the planet from various categories. Number 10. Hold up. Spider crab. The Japanese spider crab. The Japanese spider crab has the largest leg span of any anthropod, four meters from claw to claw. The body can grow to a size of 40 centimeters in terms of carapace width, and the whole crab can weigh up to 20 kilograms. The males have the long. Why, why you got talking jibber jabber? What the hell is 40 centimeters and 20 kilograms? Use the. Use the American system. Damn it, I don't understand these. Longer kilopeds. In its natural habitat, the Japanese spider crab is an omnivore and feeds on shellfish and animal carcasses and may live up to a whopping 100 years. The crab is orange with white spots along the legs. Despite looking scary, the crab is actually very gentle. Stop the cap. <laughs> cap. 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 Look at this thing. Look at all the damn pinchers and pointy thing. Yeah, no. That's not going to just cuddle up next to you when you see it. That motherfucker is going to think you're a dead carcass and try to eat your ass. Legs. Despite looking scary, the crab is actually very gentle. Number 9. Green Anaconda. The green anaconda is the world's heaviest and one of the longest snakes, reaching five... What, did it eat a fucking Honda? What is in its stomach? What, what? Bro, look at its stomach. Why is that, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold the fuck up. Why is that kid just standing next to it? Does it, that's what's inside. His entire family is inside his stomach. So he's like, well, might as well go in and join my family. There's so much, there's so much wrong with that picture. 0.5 meters long. More typically mature specimens can range up to 5 meters in length. The females, at around a mean length of 4.6 meters, are generally much larger in adulthood than the male. Numerous historical accounts of green anacondas are reported, often of improbable sizes. Several zoologists note rumors of snakes over 12 meters long. A $50,000 cash reward is offered for anyone who can catch an anaconda 9.1 meters or longer. Y'all can keep the 50k. That's not that won't even be enough to cover my like insurance and my hospital bills. Nah, maybe like 50 50 mil. Yeah, then maybe I'll think about it. But a 9.1 meter or longer anaconda. Hey Siri, how long is a meter? Even Siri don't know. Sorry, I'm having trouble with the connection. Oh, never mind. I just got bad Wi-Fi. I was about to say, I don't know. I don't know how long a damn meter is, but that just sounds that just sounds big because it has to be big. No, I, nope. Is offered for anyone who can catch an anaconda 9.1 meters or longer. Number eight, ocean sunfish. The ocean sunfish, or mola mola is the heaviest bony fish in the world with a weight of 1,000 kilograms. The species is native to tropical and temperate waters around the globe. It resembles a fish head with a tail and its main body is flattened laterally. Sunfish live on a diet consisting mainly of jellyfish, but because this diet is nutritionally poor, they consume large amounts to develop and maintain their great bulk. Females of the species can produce more eggs than any other known vertebrate, up to 300 million at a time. 
why am I just now hearing about this animal then? If it if if the female can produce three hundred million freaking eggs, then there would be millions upon millions of these damn things swimming around. And I'm just now hearing about this big ass fish head with a tail. Number seven. I don't know what the hell they're teaching us in school, but it's not the right thing. Like I feel like all we need to know is how to add, subtract, multiply. Freaking how to write a check, how to start a bank account, how to do my taxes in a fucking mola mola or whatever the fuck that thing was called. Chinese giant salamander. The Chinese giant salamander is the largest salamander in the world, Ooh. reaching a length of 1.9 meters. Why are you touching The Chinese me? giant salamander feeds Ooh. on insects, frogs, crabs, shrimp, and fish. It has very poor eyesight, so it depends on special sensory nodes that detect vibration. The female lays around 400 to 500 eggs in an underwater breeding cavity, which is guarded by the male until the eggs hatch after 50 to 60 days later. It is considered critically endangered due to habitat loss and overcollecting, as it is considered a delicacy. Number 6. No. Saltwater Crocodile the saltwater crocodile is the largest of all living rep is that a hippo? reptiles. It is found mainly in northern Australia. Mature males can exceed 6 metres and weigh more than 1,000 kilograms. This species... 1,000 kilograms is 2,200 pounds. Damn. ...is the only extent crocodilian to regularly exceed 4.8 metres. Females are much smaller and often do not surpass around three meters in length. As the name implies, this species of crocodile can live in salt water. The saltwater crocodile look. is an opportunistic apex predator capable of taking any animal that enters its territory. Number five, polar bear. The largest living land carnivores are the polar bear and the Kodiak bear at around 700 kilograms in weight. Kodiak bears range from 200 to 315 God. kilograms for females and 360 to 700 kilograms for males. Females are typically about 20% smaller and 30% lighter than males. The polar bear is a marine mammal because it spends many months at sea. It is the only living marine mammal with powerful legs that allow them to run on land. The heaviest polar and brown bear weights recorded were respectively 1,003 kilograms and 1,135 kilograms. Hell Number no. four, elephant seal. The southern elephant seal is the largest carnivore living today at around 4,000 kilograms in weight. This seal's size shows extreme sexual dimorphism, possibly the largest of any mammal, with the males typically five to six times heavier than the females. While the females average 400 to 900 kilograms in weight, that's got to be the worst nose I have ever seen on anything in my entire life. Look at it. Look at it. That thing's as big as that damn penguin back there and as crooked as a damn staircase. That joke did not make any sense. I don't know. It just came. That's what just popped up in my head. You know, some, sometimes it's hard, okay? Right and two to three meters in length. Something that his nose is not. <laughs> the bulls average 2,200 to 4,000 kilograms and 4.5 to six meters. The record sized bull shot in 1913 measured Look six- Look at him. Look at him, he's like, it's all right, little baby, I got you. I got you little, you my boo thing. You know you're my little boo thing, I'll protect you, baby. 0.85 meters long and weighed 5,000 kilograms. Yeah. Number three, giraffe. The giraffe is an African mammal, the tallest living terrestrial animal and the largest ruminant. Fully grown giraffes stand at 5.5 meters tall and the tallest recorded male was 5.88 meters. The maximum recorded weight is 1,930 kilograms for an adult male. The giraffe has an extremely elongated neck which can be over two meters in length, which makes up for almost half the animal's vertical height. Bro, if if y'all have ever been to the zoo that has giraffes, oh, I got the hiccups. Bro, they are huge. 
They are huge. Like, it, it, pictures and shit do not do it justice. You see them in real life, they are hella fucking tall, bro. Giraffes eat the twigs of trees, which are important sources of calcium and protein to sustain its growth rate. Number two, African bush elephant. The African bush elephant is the largest living terrestrial animal and is larger than the forest elephant. On average, males are 3.3 meters tall at the shoulder and 5.5 tons in weight, while females are much smaller at 2. How, but how do they get this picture right here? How do you, you're just sitting there taking pictures of elephants and you see a bunch of damn, what are those, lions? You see a bunch of lions just run up on it and start attacking it and you're just going to sit there and ch -ch 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 -ch. Bro, what'd the elephant do? For you to just document its death. 0.5 meters tall and three tons in weight. The most characteristic features of African elephants are their very large ears, which they use to radiate excess heat, and their trunk with fingers at the end of it. The adults have no predators due to their size, but the calves are vulnerable to lion and crocodile attacks. And number one, blue whale. At 30 meters in length and 180 metric tons in weight, the blue whale is the largest known animal. The blue whale has some of the largest organs. Its tongue weighs around 2.7 tons. And when fully expanded, its mouth is large enough to hold up to 90 tons of food and water. The heart of the blue whale weighs the same as a mini cooper and is the largest known in any animal. Unfortunately, blue whales have relatively small brains. During the summer, the blue whale consumes 40 million krill a day, which is a whopping 1.5 million calories. So he's he big and dumb. Big and dumb. My life story. All right, guys, that is it for this reaction. If y'all like these type of videos, y'all let me know down in the comments. Let me know by leaving a like on the video. Y'all been showing hella support here recently. I love you guys. I really do. So if you're new to this channel, join the love. We share love and positivity. That's all I want my channel to be. So join the love. Hit that subscribe button. We're on over to 2,000 subscribers. I love you guys so much. I really do. And like I said, leave a comment. Drop a like if y'all want to see more of these. And other than that, stay to your reaction. I'm out. Peace.